Welcome everybody to Rare World Coins. Hopefully I'm providing you with some useful information and of course on tips on what you need to look for on a particular coin as far as grading. Be sure you have the three things that I always look for a coin, which is appeal, scarcity, and demand. So appeal that the coin looks very decent, uh, no heavy bag marks or ugly toning. Um, be sure that uh, the coin is scarce, the coin has been melted down, many handled, uh, or, uh, uh, or recalled, uh, melted, and of course that, that the coin has only a few surviving numbers, that there is a demand for these coins in very high grade. Uh, this one here is... Uh, ICGS graded 64, 1928A, 5 mark. Uh, this is the Lessing commemorative. This is a very nice high grade, number 64. The coin has very nice full cartwheel luster. Very hard to find in this beautiful grade. Low mintage, and of course, especially in this very high condition, very few surviving in this high MS-64. On the reverse, the German Eagle, exceptionally very clean. Normally you'll see a lot of bag marks on this particular field due to the wide space it has. So this will have lots of contacts normally on this coin. So finding one exceptionally clean is very nice and appealing. So this is what you want to look for in these coins. And of course the 1929A has a higher mintage, but when you get to a high grade as this, it does get pretty scarce. So hopefully if you like to collect German coins, uh, this is probably one of the earlier dates that you can collect as a type with a decent grade and does not cost you so much. But as they get to a higher grade, Definitely, they start uh, costing maybe between five to eight hundred dollars. This one here is around five hundred dollars in this particular grade, but the uh, the coin will continue to increase in value as the the collector demand on this particular coin continue to increase. Hopefully, that information will help you out. So, if you like what you hear and you like the the video I provided, uh, please subscribe to my channel, give me a thumbs up, and if you have any questions. By all means, uh, send me your comments. Till next time.